What's up, everybody? Jason here from Jaspies eBay, presented by JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. We're doing our last break of the night here on eBay, Jaspies eBay. 2015-16 Upper Deck Opeachy Platinum Hockey. There you go. So there you go. Quickly list out the list of customers in this break. Ryan with the Ducks. Ryan M with the Ducks. Ryan H with the Yotes. Dave with the Bruins. Chris with the Sabres Flames. Philip with the Hurricanes. Drew with the Panther. I mean, sorry, with the uh, Hawks. Joe Pizzle with the Avalanche and Blue Jackets. Ryan with the Stars. Jeff with the Red Wings. Joe Pizzle with the Oilers. Chris with the Panthers. Candy with the Kings. Ryan with the Wild. Chris with the Canadians. Drew with the Preds. Chris with the Devils. Jamie with the Islanders. Candy with the Rangers. Chris with the Senators. As well as the Flyers. Lou with the Penguins. Ryan with the Sharks. Ryan with the Blues. Rob with the Lightning. Chris with the Leafs. Canucks. Ryan with the Capitals. And Drew with the Jets. <clears throat> so, here you go. Eight boxes of OPG Platinum. Good luck. Still should be a lot of really nice hits in these last eight boxes. <clears throat> Love me some Platinum, guys. OPG Platinum. One of my favorite products to rip open. Good luck. And what sport, fuzzy card? John Monahan. Well, I'm wearing a Kings jersey. I'm here in LA, I'm a big Kings fan, so they're always going to be my number one answer, Kopitar. But uh, other than that, I really am a big fan of Austin Matthews and Ovechkin. Matt Pumpel, Rookie Tracks, Nyquist, Vladimir Tarasenko, Duchesne. Alright, Getzlaff. Hoffman, Pominville, and Sergey Platnikov, rookie auto rainbow. Penguins going to Lou. Nice Dylan Larkin, white ice to 199. Holby to 75 blue cubes. Jeff Carter for my Kings, 113 of 149. Del Rose and Fiala. There you go. Box one in the books. Next box.
Yeah, I don't think we have hockey right now at the moment, man. We'll be getting a lot of hockey very soon. I think we'll be start putting up some soon, within the next week or so, but we're moving to a new store very soon, and once we get there, um, we'll be able to get a lot more upper deck stuff. Yeah, guys, you guys want to check out our website. We don't really have much hockey right now, but we'll be having some very soon. But in the meantime, we do have a lot of other sports on there as well. You can get $10 off your first purchase. Use that code eBay. Plotnikov or Plakanik, sorry. No Hannafin. <laughs> we got Kevin Fiala rookie tracks. That's not bad. That's pretty nice. Predators. Drew with that one. Olmark, he actually is playing a lot now for the Sabres. Ben Bishop. Taves, Domi. Oh, let's see what we got over here. And a Victor Arvidsson. That's a nice one. Rookie Auto, Rainbow. Predators. Had him on my fantasy team as well. One health. This guy's a beast. And we got a Nicholas Patan. Gold Rainbow, 31 of 149. Also, too, guys, these NHL legends, I think anything over 150, these legends are short prints as well. So, that's also, when you ship out to you, you guys can get some really nice stuff and collect a little set. James Van Reams deck to 199. Toronto Maple Leafs White Ice. Going to Chris. There you go, Chris. And we got a Mike McCarron for the Montreal Canadiens. Black Ice, 29 of 99. Canadiens also going to Chris. Alrighty, two boxes down. Yeah, Saros is, I, I like him too. I actually, my brother, my brother collects a lot of hockey jerseys game used and um, I'm always wearing his Milwaukee Admirals game used jersey. Every, every once in a while. But yeah, I like Saros a lot too. I have a lot of actually Saros rookie cards myself. I still have a really, really nice, I think, four or five color patch at a cup that I have never sold. I'm just going to keep it. It's priceless to me. Although I think I can get some good money for it now. I got it as a gift from one of my customers a couple years ago. And I, I just kept it, you know, it's a gift. But if I ever wanted to get rid of it, it's pretty nice. <laughs> Don't cup hockey stuff, so, but I'm just going to keep it. Yeah, he was really good this year in that. I mean, he's the future, you know? He's the future for the Predators, really. I know he's tiny, he's small, but he's pretty damn good. You know, uh, Pekka Rene is going to play forever, so he's definitely pretty good. And yeah, and this year's class of 15, 16, Predators are a great value. Because you get Arverson rookies, Sorrows rookies. I don't think Sorrows has autographs in this, but and then you get Kevin Fiala. Oh, did he have a shutout today? Yeah, man. Sorrow should be taking over already as the number one goalie, but 
I think they're still gonna roll with, with Pekka Rene, but although I haven't kept up the last couple weeks or so with hockey, since my Kings are kinda out of the playoffs already, kinda haven't been watching too much. And actually breaking at night kinda kinda stops me unless I have the TV around. Actually, my Kings are actually playing right now, but I wish I can get home and watch them for a little bit. Yeah, no, Saros is pretty awesome. All right, next box. Lou Erickson, Andrew Ladd, Catan, Rainbow, Hammond, Belusky. Don Skoy. <laughs> would be really nice is to get like a surge. Emerald surge or like a one of one golden treasures. Daniel Sprong, rookie auto. 98 of 99 for the uh, Penguins. Oh, I, I bet. I, I had recently had a couple customers that are actually in the Nashville area too. And they're like, damn. I mean, that's the one thing with hockey is, like, when your team's really good, prices go up extremely high. That's why I was here for the Kings, too, when they won a couple Stanley Cups in the early 2010s. Prices were crazy. But now, I mean, I can go to a Kings game to sit, like, in the top deck. I mean, it's not bad hockey view, but I can get it for, like, 10, 15 bucks now. 53 or 149, where before, you know, when the Kings were much better winning Stanley Cups in the playoffs... Those tickets, nosebleed tickets, used to be like sixty, seventy-five dollars, close to a hundred, which is crazy. Felix Potvin, Felix the Cat, NHL Legend, forty-four, fifty, Black Ice. But yeah, man, enjoy it. I think the Predators are pretty solid. I like them too. I like Soros a lot, so I root for them too. I think if like when the Kings are in the playoffs, my East Coast teams are definitely like Toronto number one, just because I love Matthews. Austin Matthews, and then I always like root for the Preds too. Alrighty, cool. Next box. Alright, halfway through the break, guys. So again, this is going to be our last break of the night. We'll be back tomorrow. I think we have five breaks scheduled. We have some great Iron Kings football 2015. We have three breaks, uh, five box breaks each. <laughs> and I believe we have half case breaks of Panini Ascension basketball 17 18 scheduled for tomorrow. So again, uh, just like you guys didn't hear in the first video, I believe our building is having a scheduled power shutdown. I don't know if Edison must be doing something, so this just shut down the power by 8 o'clock, and I believe one of our last breaks is scheduled to start at 8 o'clock. So, I think once Great Iron King starts selling uh, out on our um, on our eBay listings, we might start an hour earlier, so instead of 6 and at 5, just so that way we can still break all the breaks that same day and then um, upload those videos. The promotion word, what's going on? Uh, this is number two, man. Number one was a bit earlier at 7 o'clock, 10 p.m. East Coast time. So we're just starting the number two. So we're halfway actually already to number two. At the end of the break, I'll kind of show you the hits. So in case you are in this one and you kind of missed it. But uh, if you're looking for number one, <laughs> I'll upload the video after this break is over. But since you're on YouTube, I believe our channel here has a DVR effect. So... You see that red dot just rewind it back and you can kind of rewind back I think up to two hours in the stream and you could rewatch it while I'm still live if uh, you want to watch uh, what hits were pulled out of there. A hundred bucks right now, damn. 100 bucks is to sit down in the Kings right now. <laughs> Duvin Dubnik, Saros, Anderson, Potvin. Preds and Lightning, that'd be pretty cool. Lightning, I don't know, I just feel like the Lightning always choke. They're always so good, but then they choke. Jared McCann, rookie auto. Vancouver.
I don't know. The West is definitely harder to get through. But the East Coast, man. I don't know. I just feel like Toronto should have a shot at this. But, again, they haven't been doing so well either. The Lightning have been killing it. The Lightning are pretty good. But, who knows? It's not going to shock me if they do make the Stanley Cup. I just, just feel like the Lightning always choke. Kessler. 102 of 199. Thought the Preds were going to make it there last year. But then Vegas took over, you know. Varlamov, Rainbow, Sharp, Grand Fuhr, Red Rainbow, 9 of 15. That's pretty nice. Red Rainbow, 9 of 15. Toronto Maple Leafs. Chris with that one. Alrighty, four boxes to go, guys. <clears throat> I mean, I don't think the Wendell Clark was like the biggest vet hit. Usually, in every case of a PG Platinum, at least the ones that I've done and seen, there's always one big rookie auto, one vet. And Dylan Larkin at the time was a big rookie auto, but... I've broken so much of this stuff. I w I've been able to pull two Connor McDavid's in a master. I've been able to pull a McDavid Larkin. Uh, so one time I pulled a thing of Lemieux McDavid. But there's usually one big vet auto and one big rookie auto. At least. But every case is definitely different. Like, I remember one time I was breaking. Actually here when I was at Jaspies before a couple years ago. I was doing some personal boxes. And I think I hit like a Black Ice McDavid for one customer. And the other customer was like, damn, I'm done already. Like case is over then another customer comes in decides to buy some boxes like yeah, i'll give it a shot and boom a royal blue i mean a blue cues mcdavid auto comes out we're like whoa two mcdavid autos in one case that's crazy so even though we did pull a larkin i feel like there could still be another big rookie auto in here like a mcdavid or a big vet autograph Yeah, definitely the Preds are due. I know last year was kind of goalie situation. They kind of rode with <laughs> um, with uh, Pecorine, and he was great some games, but then I just felt like he was really horrible. I feel like he got pulled at least like five, six times in the playoffs last year. He had great games, and then he had really horrible games. Definitely goaltending going into the playoffs is key. But, of course, you just can't make mistakes in the playoffs. The game's a lot slower. You know, just gotta gotta be smarter. But I think the Preds will be okay. Shankurik, Bacchus. Terabinen. Bobby Ryan. Lucic. Hartman. Yeah, he very he was last year. And I think like if that happens this year, you just roll with one of them. Like roll with Soros and just if he wins, let him continue to play. Shane Prince, rookie auto. Ottawa Senators. There you go, Chris. Nice break for you, brother. We got a Thomas Vanek white ice to one ninety nine. To Garask White Ice to 199. Boston Bruins. Now Yakupov for the Oilers to 149. And a Cam Neely for the Boston Bruins. Nice. Blue Rainbow Autographs. Is that our big vet auto? I don't know. I don't think so. I, feel like, I mean, Cam Neely is great. No, that can't be it. Big vet. Huge. 
I want this guy right here, right? All right, cool. Three boxes to go. I know, right, Chris? Damn, I'm getting treated well. Royal treatment over here. Show some love <laughs> to everybody else. All right, three boxes to go, guys. I mean, through this, through this eight boxes, I don't. There hasn't been a really big, big auto. I mean, that Cam Neely is probably one of the best because if you really think about it, you know, Shane Prince not too crazy, McCann, Plotnikov is pretty good for a white ice, but you know, not a bigger rig. Arvidsson's actually not bad actually. He's pretty good actually, and then another Plotnikov. So I feel like there'll still be a lot more rookie wise. See a little purple right there. That'd be nice if it's a purple auto. But I'm not gonna lie though, you guys have been getting some really nice color out of these out of this case in general. A number one and a number two. If we can pull like a surge or something like that, that'd be pretty awesome. But a lot of nice color has been coming out of here. This color is what actually uh, gets people to want to buy more platinum. The blue cubes, the seismic golds, all that stuff. Is, they're really beautiful cards in person, guys. Especially the, the uh, seismic golds. Sidney Crosby die cut. Shane Couric. Jack Eichel rookie, Verbata, Nino Ryder, Dylan Larkin. That's a rainbow retro. Yeah, dude, I'm telling you, there was some great steals right here. I feel like a lot of people slept on this, so you guys that actually got in, kudos to you. Like I said, this the Oilers, I mean, Oilers are a big hit or miss in here too, but I feel like they can sell for a lot more than what they did too. Matt Poompao. Rookie auto, white ice, 77 of 99. Senators with that one. Preds for that price is a steal. Charles Houdon to 199. Steve Mason. Cam Talbot, seismic goal, 50. Like I said, there was some great deals being thrown around here out of this stuff. Put that purple to last and see what comes out. And we got an Eric Stahl for the Hurricanes. Remember, these purples are beautiful, guys. 16 to 25. Hurricanes with that one. Phillip. I mean, yeah, Oilers did definitely sell for a ton more than a lot of other teams. But, again, they're like the big chase. They should, I mean, I, I think I believe they should have went for a lot more. But, again, I think Joe Pizzo got him for a good price. Hopefully, I can deliver. I mean, there's been a lot of McDavid rookies. Which actually help. I mean, I think those McDavid rookies still sell between five to ten bucks, you know, easily. Like, you know, and I think I pulled them at least like eight of them already. So that kind of does help the cost a little bit. But of course, I want to pull a McDavid autograph. That'd be awesome. We got two boxes, guys. Good luck. Or not you? I mean, you don't even have to pull a McDavid autograph in this. Actually, I pulled Joe Pizzle like a seismic gold McDavid, and it wasn't even an autograph. And I think he sold it for like 350 you know so you don't even need to have an autograph of mcdavid in this stuff just get something numbered and you're good
Alrighty, second to last box, everybody. Good luck. Pilich. Tracks rookie. Dela Rose. Panarin. Shore rookie Zetterberg Matt Murray rainbow rookie for the pet uh, penguins oh, really gotta hide in. Wow Talented trophies Yari Hoodler and it's an autograph right inside the damn uh, Trophy <laughs> that's pretty cool I could auto. Those are very rare, guys. There's usually odds on this stuff, and I guarantee you this is pretty rare. And this is from 1516. Calgary Flames going to Chris. That's sweet. To 199. Hoodler again. Yeah, man, as always bring the good money in this stuff. That's why. To 199, Jordan Eberle. Although I think oh, a lot of teams went for a bargain. Even the Sabres at four bucks. I think four Jack Eichel rookies already make your money back. And it's probably already been enough of those. Derek Brassard to 149. Uh, Chris does, the one that's actually chatting above you, the promotion. Alrighty, guys, down to the last box. Good luck. Last box, good luck. Jonas Hiller, Peke Rene, and Hunting Tracks, Yari Hiddler, Ovi, Bergeron, Pareko, That'd be nice. I'd like to play some Kings hits. And we got Andrew Hammond for the Ottawa Senators. Chris. And there's another McDavid rookie right there. Again, these are going to add up big time. A lot of McDavid rookies in this case. There you go, Joe Pizzo. 
Mike McCarron to 199 for the Montreal Canadiens. We got a Phil Esposito gold. Oops, sorry. Rainbow to 149. And we got a purple David Backus to 25. St. Louis Blues with that one. And there you guys go. That was the break. That was Opeachy Platinum number two on eBay. Again, I'll quickly go through the list of autos and stuff that were pulled in this break. Quickly just talk about this. But I appreciate you guys getting in. Again, there were some great teams available. <laughs> so yeah, here you go. Some nice color was actually pulled out of this inner case too, or this uh, eight box break. Hammond Rook uh, autograph. Jari Hoodler for the Flames auto. Nice purple there, seismic gold. Pumpel rookie auto. Cam Neely. Shane Prince, McCann, Sprong, Arvidsson, and Plotnikov. So yeah, I think you guys got out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. A little extra bonus auto on this one. So there you guys go. Remember, go to our website, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Use that code to get ten dollars off your first purchase on that website. eBay is the code. And again, this will be our last break of the night, so we'll see you guys.